what's up you guys and welcome back to my channel um, if you're new to my channel my name is Brooklyn or Brooke or BK whatever you want to call me and as you can see from today's thumbnail and the boxes behind me um, I'm going to be doing a brutally honest review of just fab I'm sure a lot of you have seen ads for just fab on Instagram or Facebook but if you haven't um, just fab is an online subscription retailer that um, specializes in shoes but they also have everyday uh, fashion accessories um, they also run fabletics fab kids fat fab kids fab kids and I uh, I believe they also run shoe dazzle no one asked for my honest opinion on this company and their products but I have been looking at a lot of other uh, influencers out there and it's really hard to find someone who has the same body type as me um, I am about six feet tall I weigh well, I shouldn't tell you how much I weigh but <laughs> I'm thick and I have a size 11 foot so finding things that fit me every day is a little challenging and I figured summer's coming I'm gonna need a new wardrobe so the things that I do find I want to share with you guys um, so if you are about the same size as me or if you have similar uh, issues finding things that fit maybe my reviews can help you out too my goal here is to take an unbiased look at this company um, and give you an honest review although I will say <laughs> I have purchased from just fab before it was years ago and I love the shoes the quality was great the styles were pretty versatile and overall great quality like that they still last me to this day but they're kind of old so I need something that's more in season a little more with everyday fashion and yeah I just needed an upgrade on my shoe collection <laughs> so let's get into how just fab works so when you go onto their website you typically will take a style quiz where you pick out certain shoes that fit your everyday wardrobe and then they'll take your answers and create a personalized boutique and through that boutique will be mostly what they think you will wear um, you can also search specific styles if there is a specific look that you're wanting some of the shoes that I have here today I did search for they did not automatically come up in my boutique uh, which is okay um, and then upon checkout they offer the VIP subscription which I did sign up for the main reason I signed up for it I will be completely honest I saw that they were doing a $10 shoe VIP membership deal so several of these pairs of shoes that I got I I only got them for $10 you guys um, some of them I did pay um, I think maybe two pairs I paid like maybe 20 bucks so overall I got a whole new shoe wardrobe for the summer under a hundred dollars and that to me was a steal I could not pass it up I needed new shoes so yeah this worked out great for me um, as far as the subscription service goes I will have to keep y'all updated on how I feel about that some of the main perks that caught my eye about the VIP membership is that you do get a new personalized boutique every month. It's not the same shoes every month. Um, and if it's not in your budget, you can always skip the month. Uh, and you do get 30% off. So if you needed last minute new pair of kitten heels or um, a new pair of booties, like you could go on there and any shoe style that you like as a VIP membership, you are going to get 30% off. So that's nice. Um, and you can also just cancel anytime if it's just not something that you want to stick with. So I'm going to take these boxes down so I know the names of the shoes. That way, if you're interested, you could look them up too. So like I said, I want to keep this as unbiased as possible, but I did go into the Just Fab shopping experience knowing that in the past when I bought from them their size 11s have been true to size and very comfortable so I was pretty confident in my shoe selection this time around and that whatever I got would fit me right um, spoiler alert I've already tried on all these shoes and things have definitely changed since four years ago <laughs> so 
let's get started. The first shoe that I am trying on is the flat sandals wild and free. I got them in the color black. Uh, they're kind of this snakeskin, faux snakeskin style, um, and I got them in a size 11. I really like the squared uh, shape of the shoe. I feel like that style is going to be very popular this summer. And this is the outfit that I paired with it just because it's what I was wearing today. I typically wear, you know, cute loungy clothes. Or pajamas and I wanted to get a sandal that was for everyday wear and you could just put it on and go about your day so this was definitely a fun buy um, as far as the wear goes it was a little tight I think that after some wear it will loosen up um, but I don't like that in a new shoe I think a new shoe should have some kind of form to it but it shouldn't feel like as soon as you move a certain way it's gonna snap and that's kind of the feeling that I get from this but this was one of the pairs that I got for ten dollars so I couldn't really can't really complain for the price the next shoe I am trying on is the flat sandals called passport to sale I got them in the color blush and also in a size 11 with this shoe I will say it seems a little cheap <laughs> these definitely come across as like a cheaper pair but again I wanted sandals that I could just put on and go and that would look cute with most of the outfits that I have in my wardrobe um, and as you can see I'm, I paired it with the same outfit that I wore with the black sandals and I think that it will just add the the pop of uh, flavor to any outfit that I have in my wardrobe. Excuse me, I have the sniffles. The next shoe I am trying on, the Scene Stars flats. I got them in a size 11 as well. These flats caught my eye because of the fun little studs on the top of the shoe. I also needed an everyday flat to wear to work and more white in my wardrobe so this shoe really just stood out to me and I was excited to get it. My one complaint would be that it is very tight and definitely going to have to break in this shoe but I feel like after a couple wears it will be more comfortable and I did a little wardrobe change for you guys just to give you an idea of what I would wear this kind of shoe with. Um, I like to wear blazers, I like to wear... Um, dressy tops typically with jeans and so if I'm wearing jeans I always like to wear a cute shoe with my pair of jeans and like I said this was just had to had to get it I really hope that I can break these in because if I can't I don't see myself reaching for them as often but they're just so cute I couldn't pass up for ten dollars all right, these shoes I was really looking forward to getting because I don't have a whole lot of color in my wardrobe when it comes to my shoe accessories. So when I saw these bright yellow um, heels, I had to have them. These are called the Claim to Fame dress sandals in yellow and also in a size 11. I will say though, when I was putting these on, the belt buckle was not uh, cooperating with me and after finally getting them on, I really like the feel of these. Again, I think with any professional or casual look, you can really add a pop of color to your outfit with these. Um, and after I tried them on and I took them off, I figured out if you just slip the back of this heel part right here off, they they come right off and you can slip them back on just as easily so I would not mess with this buckle it is a nightmare um, I would only mess with it if you need to adjust but other than that these are just slip on and off which is perfect for me because I'm a gotta go kind of gal <laughs> here are the Aaron flat sandals in metallic also in a size 11 I wanted again I like an everyday shoe that I can just slip on and run out of the house and I needed something that was a little more dressy for work or those girl night outs which I can't wait to get back to and the sequins on these well I don't even know if they're sequins but it's uh the very tiny like crystals on here so I put them on with one of my work outfits just to see how 
off it would look and it really didn't look that off um, like I said if I'm in a hurry and summer is coming up so it's gonna be hot out and I need something that's breathable these shoes will do just fine oh these next shoes I am so excited about these I had to go looking for these shoes I told the just fab boutique I was looking for booties and these did not come up but I knew that they had to have something like these um, I I'm obsessed with the Americana feel of these shoes. They are definitely a versatile shoe as far as the seasons. I could see myself wearing these this summer, in the fall, or the winter. So I'm really excited to break these in. Um, and as you can see, I paired them with one of my fringe jackets. My favorite saying is, if loving fringe is wrong, I don't want to be right. <laughs> My one critique about these shoes is that they're very tight and um, a constant with all of these shoes I would say is that they're all kind of tight and although they fit my size 11 foot fairly well I am worried that that tightness is going to get looser and not with that typical wear and tear kind of loose I'm worried that they're gonna fall apart loose so we shall see um, I am NOT a pointed boot kind of girl these are a new for me <laughs> so I will let y'all know um, on my Instagram uh, you'll see me wearing them and if not you'll know that they didn't work out <laughs> but I'm very excited about these okay so now that I've tried six pairs of just fab shoes it's time for my verdict are these shoes worth it or should you pass up on the new membership deal let's get into it I will say that for ten dollars a pair for I want to say four out of the six of these shoes it was totally worth it I got a whole new shoe wardrobe for the summer and if they fall apart they fall apart if they last as long as my old just fab shoes um, then great but would I recommend the monthly membership I probably would not just because it is almost $40 a month um, and as you can see from like this pair this this shoe was not the best quality and it's cute it'll do for the summer but I think this sh this shoe let's see how much this one retailed for you guys this shoe retails for $42.95. It is not worth $42.95. And I know that with the VIP membership, you get 30% off of your shoes, but even then, it's not worth it. <laughs> I only got this shoe because it was on sale for $10. But let's say a shoe like this. This one was, this shoe regularly retails for $59.95 and I got it for 20 bucks. So this is definitely one of those shoes that I would probably consider on a monthly basis. Like, oh, the last pair worked out really well for me. Maybe next month I'll get the pair in blue because these did come in blue as well. At the end of the day, I truly believe that the shoe quality since four years ago when I got my other pairs and they are still sitting in my closet, um, the quality has gone down for sure and I would be wary of the shoes that you do get but know that there is a return policy so you can probably return shoes that don't fit you well or if you just don't like the feel of them um, but for me this is a good haul this is a good start to the summer for my wardrobe and I look forward to seeing all the fun looks that I can put together with it just to be clear I love all of these shoes that I got I'm so excited to pair them with my summer outfits I just don't think that spending $40 a month on a pair of shoes that probably aren't made of the best quality is worth it but I do think that if you find a shoe like this that is pretty decent quality and totally worth the 40 bucks then go for it um, and if you liked any of these shoes uh, in my review, I will link them all below. And if you decide that Just Fab is something that you want to try, um, I do have a referral link below. Um, I'm not, this video isn't sponsored, but if you do use the link below, you get um, $10 on your first pair of shoes and then also an exclusive discount on other pairs, which is kind of what I did here. I also signed up Kyle so I could 
finesse that system but I think it's a really good deal and and you're helping your girl out I get $15 towards my next purchase for every friend that I refer so if you get a pair of shoes let me know if you like them and maybe I'll get them too all right you guys so just fab decent quality average pricing and size 11 fits me pretty well like I said the only one that I'm worried about are these pointy shoes but fingers crossed I can break them in yeah so let me know what you guys think about my little shoe haul and if you've ever purchased from just fab before I'd like to know what your experience was like good negative um, yeah let me know in the comments I really enjoyed doing this video again I struggle finding other women who have the same body structure as me as well as finding shoes that fit me so I really hope that this was a helpful review and if you want to see more of these please do me a favor and hit that like button and subscribe all right you guys thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time bye